Hola. Acabamos de ir a visitar a Kate al hospital eh, por su intento de suicidio que conseguimos salvar, ¿vale? Voy poniéndose un poquito al día y eh, hemos investigado en el garaje de David, que David se Hey Max, casa. how are you doing? Oh, hi Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for the school. It's a long story. In actual files here. No, me fío del I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? Es demasiado majo. It's weird just no me fío being on campus maja. like everything's normal. I know, lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. So, you don't hate me for what I said to the principal? I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Hot for teacher. Gross! You are out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Voy a ver qué fotos tengo que hacer en este capítulo. Bueno, aparte de que tengo SMS de Chloe. Vale. Eh, las fotos que tengo que hacer en este. Por cierto, a ver cuáles hice en el anterior episodio. Vale. Hice. Room, vale. See if I can vale. find out where Nathan is. That's so ironic that Warren asked Max to the drive. Hey, Brooke, how are you? I'm here as usual. By the way, thanks for helping Kate down. Are you okay? I, I can't get my limited brain around that eclipse and the beached whales. I was hoping the science department had some ideas. Warren and I are supposed to compare notes and theories this weekend. <coughs> <coughs> oh, he asked you? You know, science geeks stick together. But honestly, neither of us can explain this phenomenon. It's pretty scary. I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and everything. Okay, Brooke. Um, but right now I'm trying to find Nathan. Warren's not good enough for you? Okay. I saw Nathan pissed and walking off campus earlier. Good luck getting that date, Max. I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Really? I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Okay, where did these rocks come from? This is too Blair Witch for me.
One photo. For posterity. Huellas, luego nido y tal, vale. Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. Because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. Way too much. I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. How are you? Sad and confused, like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, too. I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Oh, many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. What do you think about all those dying birds? Samuel had to bury dozens near the Tabanga. Is that cool with the Tabanga? We'll find out if the souls of the bird move on. Not that we can prove it. It's so ominous. Unless it's fate, then it doesn't matter. How can anybody explain all those poor beached whales? My dad was a fisherman, and he'd take me out to hear the whales sing. Now they... they just cry. Do you think this is some kind of eco-disaster, or...? I think it's more than that. Somebody is causing all this to happen. You think so, Samuel? You and Arcadia Bay are connected by time and tide, so... Next time I have a question, I'm coming to you. Oh, I'm glad to see your squirrels are still healthy and happy on the campus. Me too. If something happened to them... Oh. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The only thing that calms them is food. <laughs> Lots of food. Which reminds me th that I have to feed them now. Sí, tengo que hacer foto a esto. Sad. Makes me mad. Climate change isn't real my ass. How would you like a partner for a quick photo op? As a scientist, I'm fascinated. As Michelle Grant, I'm. ¿Cómo era la foto? Eh, no. No hay. Mm. Very worried. Arcadia Bay is scared too. Look at the weather and the animals. Not to mention, get that me. food in your belly. Ah, no, ya se comen la foto. These days. Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. And I swear, it's not about that petition you didn't sign. I was looking for Nathan Prescott and thought he might be in your class. I'm surprised, Max. I didn't think you and Nathan were exactly friends. Just study partners. I can't believe he does have friends. That depends what your definition is. But I'd like to see more friendships at Blackwell, less bullying. Especially after this week. <laughs> so, you don't know where Nathan is? I saw him sulking off campus earlier. But you look like you have more on your mind than a question. Kate. I don't think surveillance would have helped Kate Marsh. 
Who needs surveillance when we have Maxine Caulfield? You did a wonderful thing, and now we have to make sure Kate gets the help she needs. Do you need to talk to a counselor? Blackwell Academy needs the help. There's something terrible going on here. You see it, right? This week hasn't been Blackwell's finest hour. But me and some faculty members won't rest until all the students here feel safe, not bullied. Kate was drugged at the Vortex Club party and bullied by them until she ended up on the roof. How do you stop that? Shut down that damn Vortex Club for a start. I don't mean to get riled up, but that party should have been postponed. It's extremely tasteless given what happened with Kate. Do the Prescotts have anything to do with the Vortex Club? I mean, they don't get all their money from car washes. No, they don't. But membership has its privileges. Especially when your father is Blackwell's biggest sponsor. This elitist nonsense has no place here. You're right. I, I just wish this could be the school that I dreamed about before I came here. I hear you, Max. I love seeing you and Warren and all my students at your best here. But you're all too young to be so cynical. But you truly give me hope. I was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. If I could, I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in science today. I haven't been able to wrap my mind around that eclipse, much less the snow in Wales. I think this is beyond science. Nothing is beyond science except for our lack of knowledge. We may never know why, but that doesn't change reality. I am worried about reality. I feel like it's changing right in front of us. You and Samuel both. We were talking about that before you came over. Our planet is changing, but it's not mystic. It's erosion. You think that's why all these animals are dying here? Well, our shoreline has been receding. Not to mention the daily contamination of the ocean. That's all you need to kill off sea and wildlife here. Unless you know something I don't. I wonder if the Tabanga knows more than anybody here. Oh, Max, nobody even knows who brought the Tabanga here. It was likely stolen from the South Pacific by local fishermen. But I know what you're saying. There's a lot of energy here. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. Vale. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. I have your meme in that party. A ver ahora, madre mía. It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Hostias, es el de tíos. Gate. Super Max, si todavía no necesitas el número de cuarto de Nathan, es el 11-11. O sea, el 11-11 no, el 111, o sea, el 111, gilipollas. Kate, eres increíble, gracias. Me encanta que saques la rebelde que llevo dentro. Ya eres una rebelde, créeme, siempre. Y por fin, ten cuidado, ¿me lo prometes? Claro. Oh, Kate brings it. So. Room 111 is the magic number. Are toilet paper wars mandatory in the dorms? Even after Kate, nobody here learned anything about bullying. Oh, 
jerks. At least nobody messed with the Kate portrait. This just makes me think of Kate. No permitas que te intimiden. Si eres víctima de acoso, no estás solo. Ven y unete al grupo de apoyo de discusión mensual. Discreción garantizada. Con tanto, la la la. This can only be Nathan's room. Oh. Now I need to find Nathan's phone, or anything with clues. That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Yes. Bastard. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the pro I really hope they were all consenting models. That is so Chloe. Ay, capullo, tenemos que hablar. Le cuento a todo el mundo lo que hiciste. Y le vas a y le vas a pagar, hijo de puta. Whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. Must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. Sí, la verdad. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. Ah, sí, sí, totalmente. A ver. I don't think this prescription has helped Nathan. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. <laughs> oh man, that dickhead stole one of my selfies. Hola, eso acojona. That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has a light side. I can rewind if he shows up, but I can't count on it. I know. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Para Victoria. Hola guapa, dime que te vas a poner para la fiesta del vortex de esta semana para que me ponga algo a juego, caro y elegante. Estoy deseando que llegue y voy a llevar provisiones. Hasta le he dicho a mi viejo que, le, que aleje a los cerdos de Blackwell para que no nos jodan la diversión. Si es una fiesta del fin del mundo, habrá que hacer las cosas bien, ¿no crees? Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Arrea. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. A ver, de su padre para Nathan, ¿vale? Nate, sé que ha sido una semana tensa y tu madre y yo estamos aquí para hablar si es necesario. Pide cita en cualquier momento. Tu madre quiere que el doctor Bill venga después de la gira de promoción de su libro. 
Pero por ahora sigue con lo que te recetó. Necesito que estés tranquilo hasta la apertura de la organización PAN. Sé que ser un prescote es una carga y te guiaré paso a paso, como hizo mi padre. Fue difícil para mí cuando él me abrió los ojos a nuestro destino. Pero me lo agradecerás algún día, no te preocupes por, por Blackwell. Le vamos a poner un enema a este pueblucho de mierda. Quiero que estés listo para sucederme cuando llegue el momento. No la cagues, hijo, tu padre. Arrea. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. Su hermana, Christine Prescott. Eh, Todo ven desde Brasil, mi hermanito. Hace siglos que no sé nada de ti. Así que cuéntame qué está pasando en tu emocionante vida académica en Blackwell, fardo de mis compis. Bueno, leerlo, ¿vale? Lo parece aquí y lo leís. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Supresor de apetito. Hostia, chaval. Wow. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Del director, Nathan. Quisiera ir culpable por la reciente acusación. Tu nombre y expediente hablan por sí mismos. A veces a los alumnos nos aprovechan para hacerse un nombre de Blackwell. Sé que tu padre se enfadó, pero lo hace. Bah. Le aseguré que nunca traerías un arma de fuego a la institución. No quiero que te distraigas de tus estudios. Estoy seguro de que este asunto se resolverá antes de que acabe la semana. Si tienes alguna pregunta, sabes que estoy siempre disponible para hablar. Ahí está. Vale. No sé dónde coño. ¿Eh? Nathan Prescott. All American Teen. Culos y tetas. Marcas de arañazos. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Now I have Nathan's phone, so... Yes, I would be cool with having this high-tech projector. Vale. Vámonos. You're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> you are so fucking dead. <laughs> Get off me, bro. Vamos, vamos. Fuck. Que le den por culo a Nathan. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? 
Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! Ay, pero a lo mejor me pulsan o algo. Get off me! Vamos a ir, chaval. Please stop! He's down. Hey, come on. Stop. Sorry. Yes, we have to go. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. I mean, I'm but it's scary. scary. Shit, man. This really hurts. Que se joda. Bueno, chicos, hasta aquí este capítulo. Veremos qué pasa en el siguiente. Os quiero Damn. mucho. That was intense. <laughs> Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For being shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Bueno. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Vale, ahora sí, chicos. Nos vemos en el siguiente capítulo. Os quiero mucho. ¡Mua! Adiós. Esperamos que te haya gustado este vídeo. Por favor, dale a like, comenta y compártelo con tus amigos. ¡Y suscríbete! Gracias. Subimos, wow.